try to be everything that I can But sometimes I come out as being nothing I try to be everything that I can But sometimes I come out as being nothing I pray to God that he make me a better man Maybe one day I'ma stand for something I'm thanking God that he made you part of the plan I guess I ain't go through all that out for nothing I'm always messing up and wrecking this It seems like I perfected it I offer you my love, I hope you take it like some medicine Tell me ain't nobody better than me I think that there's better than me Hope you see the better in me Always end up better than me Hey guys, Ibra here Today we're gonna be cooking up a couple of big pompanos But first, I'm gonna show you how I catch this fish And we'll be back in the kitchen ready to clean this and cook it up <laughs> oh, it's very cruel, cruel boy. <laughs> Whoa! Yes! Buffalo! <laughs> He's so skinny! I love <laughs> Whoa! Dang! He's so skinny though! Like, he's slender. Nice. Oh, <laughs> 
<laughs> oh no! <laughs> ah. So we're out here. This is my fancy workstation. This is what I have for right now. This is what I. This is what I actually do. So we got our fish. Nice pump, you know. And yeah, I'm just gonna real quick take a scissors and cut all the fins off. But sometimes I come out as being nothing I pray to God that he make me a better man Maybe one day I'ma stand for something That fish is I'm thinking pretty God clean that he made you part of the plan. So I guess I ain't go through all that There it is, a clean fish I'm always messing up and wrecking right. this It seems like I'm perfected And then this one It's so long But I'm gonna clean this one up And I'll see you back in the kitchen this one, this type of love don't always come and go I don't want to ruin this one This type of love don't always come and go I don't want to ruin this one This type of love don't always come and go I don't want to ruin this one This type of love don't always come and go So we have all our stuff here, all the seasoning things. So we have lime of course, ginger, shadow benny, green onions, onion, garlic. This is thyme and rosemary, mint, cayenne pepper, big leaf thyme and bay leaf. So let's cut everything up and get it prepared for the pot. So we have our fish, nice pompano, all clean and seared. I put some cuts in them so all the seasoning can get into the meat. So we're gonna squeeze our lime onto the fish first and let that let this marinate in it as we prepare everything else. So lime is good. Flip it over to the other side as well. Okay, so let that sit in this lime juice and then we're gonna cut up everything else and get the pot hot and ready. Because we are actually making an Asian style pompano. So I'm gonna pan fry it first and then we're gonna finish cooking it in some a concoction of goodness so let's go If you're wondering why I put this little bit of scallions or green onions in this little bowl, this is for to sprinkle on top at the end. I just need a little bit to just garnish on top. So I'm setting aside these for that. Our fish was way too big for the frying pan. So we cut them in half so that you can properly fit in the frying pan that we have. So let's get the stove lit. And get this pan hot. And we're gonna add some oil and just pan fry it for a little bit and then we're gonna get the other skillet or pot or frying pot ready for the finished product so let's go i'm so excited it tastes so good okay our pot is pretty hot so let's get some oil in it just 
should be good. Almost. Okay. So that shouldn't take too long to heat up. Then we're gonna get the fish frying and it's gonna pop up on me. So to prevent that, I'm gonna wipe it off a little bit with a paper towel <laughs> so I don't get burnt with hot oil. So right before we put it in, it's gonna dab it dry a little bit. gonna dab it <coughs> that way it don't explode on me although it was still like pop but it's okay so let's go so I'm just gonna put that fish on a plate that's it. Yeah, that's it. Put it on the plate. And just get the tail. Uh, should I wipe it off? Nah. Good looking piece of fish though. Mm. Okay. Right, so put that on our plate and right away we're gonna get the next part on. So this is the part we're going to finish cooking it in. So using the same oil, we're going to add in our first bowl. We're going to add in our onions, garlic, um, green onions, ginger, and cayenne pepper. So that's the first thing we're adding in. So. We have a little concoction here. This is our sauce. It's um, it's oyster sauce, soy sauce, uh, sesame seed oil, and some garlic powder. Yeah, I think that's all. all right, and and some sugar. Right, and some sugar. So I'm just gonna mix that up. I'll need to add some water, but because it's really thick and and that's gonna be added to the sauce and the fish and the fish is ready to go in right now so let's put it in so the onions and and the garlic and ginger and, and everything looks good and and soft so let's add our fish in and we can add our sauce right away I added some water to it so. just like that 
And now I can add in these leftover seasons that I left back, which is the this is the small leaf thyme, rosemary, big leaf thyme, and some bay leaf too. Baby bay leaf. So add in this bay leaf and all the other seasoning. Add a little bit more to the sauce. So I'm gonna let this just need to simmer and let all the juices get into the fish. And man, if you could smell this, it smells so good. But it's almost finished, so this is gonna take about 10 more minutes and then this will be done. The fish looks about done. So, well, the fish has been done, but everything looks like it's about done. So we have a plate with a lump of rice I'm just gonna get a piece of fish I'm gonna take the tail part because that's my favorite and put it on then we're gonna get some sauce and some of this goodness on the rice Some of this goodness on there. Yes, look at that. Well, let's have a seat and enjoy the final touches which is the, the last bit of green onion just to garnish it up yes look at that can you smell it like it smells so good oh my gosh you won't believe oh, let's go let's dig in this pompano Wow, that is amazing. I'm not kidding. Like, I love Asian food, of course, and it's just so good, especially because of the the, the seasonings and, and all the greenery. It's fresh from outside, so I didn't like have to buy it or or was unsure how fresh it is because it's literally growing outside. Yeah. Oh my god. Pompano is so good. But I'm not gonna let you guys see me devour this anymore. But it's it's honestly tasting like so so good. I'm gonna continue to enjoy this. Thank you guys for watching another Hooked on Sunday video. Please subscribe, hit the like button, hit the bell so you don't miss any more videos. But I'm gonna enjoy this. You guys stay safe and stay sanitized. But I'll see you guys next week. I don't wanna ruin this one, this type of love don't always come and go We take drugs, then you hold me close, then I tell you how you make me whole Sometimes I feel you like being alone, then you tell me that